packaged chocolate. So it goes away for summer, but it will be coming back next October. So we made sure that our Today Special pricing and our Today Special sizing are a monthly special for the entire month of April. So you get the world's most delicious dark, cho dark chocolate, bar none. There isn't any dark chocolate in the world that comes close. It has the texture and mouthfeel of milk chocolate, but the rich flavor of dark chocolate. Plus, unlike any other dark chocolate, it actually will help to lower total and LDL cholesterol because the same ingredient that behaves like milk fat that's what makes milk chocolate so creamy. That same ingredient, we have something that pretends to behave like that ingredient. It's called a plant sterile ester. A plant sterile ester is mother nature's natural molecule that kind of masquerades like cholesterol. And because it masquerades like cholesterol in your digestive system, it prevents the absorption or reduces the absorption of cholesterol and bile salts. Because it can't be absorbed, it blocks and, and reduces or inhibits the absorption of cholesterol and bile salts. So it's an incredible natural tool to lower total and bad LDL cholesterol. But if all you want is the most delicious, healthy, dark chocolate, 25 calorie, low sugar square after a meal, then you want Choco Nouveau. And our new Choco Nouveau, we finally have our Choco Nouveau Cafe, not just in our 74% cacao, but also in 66 and 91. And they are, they are all three mind blowing, but the 66 and 91 are truly remarkable. So you have 66, 74, 91% of Choco Nouveau. You also have 66, 74, and 91% of Choco Nouveau Cafe. So choices of all of them, our today's special size is up to 360 count. Best pricing ever. Enjoy. You know, life is an adventure. Life's fun. I'm just one of those people that I see something, I just want to do it. I'm doing the same thing I've been doing for over 35 years. I'm really doing one-of-a-kind jewelry, and the majority of the time, the mine finds that you see on the show, it's the first time they've ever been shown. I think what really our edge is, I know exactly the story. That's what people love. They love the uniqueness of the materials that we find, but they love knowing that they're gonna have a piece of jewelry that they're not gonna see on everybody. Well, there he is, Jay King. He's our favorite rock out in the whole wide world, and we're going to rock it out tonight. Oh, that is the worst. We were on the other night, and I was doing, what was the dumb pun? I was doing the dumbest puns the other night, too. I'm full of them tonight, okay? I'm just saying. But we really are going to have a great time. He goes all around the world, and he finds these incredible gemstones. He's been doing it for many years. We're going on 28 years that Jay has been bringing us amazing jewelry. And I will tell you, the next two hours, we are ready to go. You're going to see some of the coolest stones, and we have, of course, great pricing. I had to, had to, had to feature this. Guys, I have been blessed to work with Jay now for 18 of the 28 years, okay? And boy, I, you know, I've talked a lot about his jewelry. We've seen lots of different deals. I don't think I've seen a better value in years than what you're seeing right here. You're like, hey, can I get a beautiful turquoise pendant in a heart shape carved? How gorgeous, genuine, right? All sterling silver, great big bail. We love it. How much would you spend just for that? Do you know on hsn.com, our turquoise pendants, no chain, no nothing, they start at around 130 some dollars up to 400 and some dollars so that would be pretty amazing just getting that oh hey you know what let's add a necklace to it okay that at 219 is unbelievable oh doesn't this look pretty layered together wouldn't that be great to have it all Yes, for the exact same price, you are getting two necklaces and the pendant. I've got 300 available. I will let you know when those babies are sold out. That's gonna go fast. You guys who love his stuff, you know that is an unheard of, an unprecedented value right there. Now, one more thing I'm gonna show you because we got a lot to get to, but I gotta get going, is this is just launched recently. It's on sale. I love it because I think it's really simple. It's very easy. It's very spring. It's very chic. This is our turquoise with spice the oyster which is a neat combination this is brand new we just launched it a couple days ago and we're at under $100 for this so you have a really pretty combo of your turquoise and of course this spiny oyster go with it I will have matching earrings coming up all right the next thing we're going to do is pretty challenging for Jay and I because we both love to chat. Uh, it is a, what's called a five and five. It is five items and that's going to be in five minutes and we're going to jump into it right now so let's do it. 
<laughs> hey guys, oh, what? It's your choice. What do you want? You want to be here or no? No, whatever. You'll you do it? Okay. No, I told him I, you were going to do it with me. Oh, okay. In fact, I was bragging about how good you are at the five and five. Oh, okay. Yeah, all right, here we go. Five and five. First up, it's five okay. items. They're at super good prices and they're very, very, very limited. You guys have made this a customer pick. Three strands of coral. We have a 90 available, $55 off. Jay, we always love when you do coral. Well, you know, and here's the thing but with any of the five and fives, just so everybody is completely aware of this, okay? Everything you're gonna see, all five, are all what I call stupid or ridiculous <laughs> prices, <laughs> crazy prices. Um, I mean, and you, so think about this, you're getting three strands, three strands of natural coral here, uh, red coral, and for just a ridiculous price. I mean, yeah, to tell bucks. you the truth, as, as the manufacturer, which I are, the manufacturer in this case, the designer and the manufacturer, you can't actually build it and sell it for that. No just way. if I told you just with the sterling silver enhancer on this cost right, right now, you go, that's insane. Okay, 18 inches, a two and three quarter inch extender on the back, all in sterling silver. That's gonna be sold out in just a second. Next one up, how cool is this? This is striped agate. Oh, it is my cuff bracelet. Let me pull this up. So we have a cuff bracelet. I have less than 50, $66 off. So where do you find striped agate? Okay, well, this material comes out of uh, Madagascar. It's really unique. I mean, here's the thing with agates. Um, you know, there, there's, you find agates on every continent. You find them throughout the entire world. But every agate is specific to that one deposit. That's how, how huh. rare they are. I mean, they're, like this, this agate, you won't find anywhere else on planet Earth. It only comes from that one deposit. And that's because of how they're formed. Um, I have a love-hate relationship with ag agate. I love agates <laughs> for this reason. They are so hard that when you polish them, you're gonna, you see how that glows and gleams? It's gonna stay just like that. They're not gonna dull out because they're so hard. The problem is they're so hard, the only thing you can polish or cut them with is something harder than they are, which in this case is diamond, and then black You're sapphire kidding. are the really? only things you can use. That'll only cut that, huh? That's all right, so cuts. that's available. Again, all these are wildly limited. Next one's really pretty. This is the Thulite story. $90 off. Look how gorgeous <laughs> that is. I know, isn't that fun? <laughs> Eight, that is incredible. <laughs> it's incredible. I always love design. your face okay, when you see the no, prices. But I want everybody to think about this. Okay, this is one of our gallery <laughs> collection pieces. They're all handcrafted. Uh, the only This is yeah. like insane, okay? You can, does, do you see the amount of silver in this? Yeah, look at and that. Again, this is all hand done. Um, I don't know if you've actually seen the price of silver lately. It's not going down, okay? <laughs> it's not plummeting. No. I, I get up every morning and actually, I, you know, I do everything. I even do my special dance to try to get it to go down. But um, here's, the, here's the truth about anything with any kind of silver like this, guys. Yeah. Um, the prices are only going to go up. They're, it's not going down. and. It doesn't look good for the future either because of the needs, uh, especially the new needs with a lot of uh, the electric equipment. Um, the the uh, pr uh, silver prices are just going to continuously go up. Go up, yeah. So if you're looking for them to go down, you want to get the five and five. <laughs> <laughs> All right, another item, amber. I really love amber, especially this time of year when it's starting to heat up. Amber's super lightweight. It literally floats. Uh, and I think this is just a gorgeous, almost just like a classic design with this. This is like, okay, so th this is something, it's just a classic piece, right? Something that you, that you will constantly be a go-to piece uh, in your in your jewelry box. I mean, th these are the things that you'll constantly can accessorize with. You can they're big enough that you can hang pendants on them. You can wear it as a standalone. And this is natural Ukrainian amber. They're calling it brown here in the industry. We actually call this cognac. It's beautiful too. It's and such the, a gorgeous tone. Well, you know, and what I love about okay, well, another thing with amber. You know, what's going on with amber is this. There's only. There was only really two major sources. Uh, one was the Baltic Sea and the other was Ukraine. Everybody knows kind of what the Baltic material is gone. I mean, you just, nothing is coming out. Ukraine right now is a little bit of turmoil, so nothing's coming out. So what we're seeing right now is the uh, amber prices going way up. Yes, all right, and 
That's an interesting story we don't have time for. <laughs> but we will talk about it a little bit later. Then one more, check out this one. This reminds me just of mint, minty mint beauty. Look at the coloration and think about all the stuff we love to wear white in the spring and summer. How gorgeous is this? This is gonna be a green opal. How neat is that? $92 off, $92. I have 60 of you to ever own this now. This is, okay, think about this. This is natural green opal. And you know, so even, cool. even that price, you know, even if you could buy the pendant for that, you would be yeah. great, right? But you get this, look at Unvacari, look at the size of this. You get this amazing, all natural uh, green opal. And this isn't the Serbian material. This is a new material that we're getting out of the Indonesia now. So, um, you know, it's very rare to find this color, a natural, a natural opal. And it really does, I think, you know, the, the key word there, the color is a mint. It's like a mint green, real soft. Gorgeous. The only other uh, natural opal I've ever had like this actually was a small deposit that we got out of Serbia. All right, guys, so here's the story. The five and five, they are now done. Thank you, Jenny, for joining me with it. Um, and just remember, everything's really limited. Here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna predict this is gonna be one of the busiest nights we've had, and Jay's been on a couple times. We have another item coming up. You've gotta stick around to see. It's not even till next hour, but I told my producer we're gonna start showing it in this hour because you're just gonna be overjoyed at how awesome it is. And now we have some new launches. Check this out. Oh, my goodness. This is a brand new new launch it is on sale if you love your pinks if you love your purples look at my nails they're in pink right now you are going to absolutely adore this and it's pink opal and phosphiterite <laughs> i said it right right pretty close Phos Phos well potato potato well how do you say Phos phosphorciterite oh i missed a syllable in there didn't there, phos I? Phos oh, <laughs> right say that four times fast no kidding okay so <laughs> Here again, you, who do you think designed this? This is you, Jay. <laughs> <laughs> it, it was so funny. We've been working together forever. But every time my wife, you know, before we go on air, um, she will, all the time she go, this is, you didn't do this. You didn't do or, that. Or you did didn't you? do this. Yeah. Or she goes, this has got you written all over yeah. it. You Wait, know, I'll so. pick one that he didn't do. <laughs> oh, no, I know exactly what it is. Jay did not do this one. I didn't. It's right. <laughs> Brian did. <laughs> <laughs> I can tell you. But I mean, it's coming up. Is that is So what that, are you trying to say? Wow. It's, it's too artistic or no. what? <laughs> <laughs> well, you know what I love about your designs? You really love a showpiece. Well, That's, I really appreciate that. You know, here's my thing. You know, like, uh, my, my whole life is go big or go home. I mean, I got, you know, if you, if you see my life, you know, like, um, I, you know, I, I wear a lot of, I wear a lot of watches. I wear different jewelry cuffs, everything, uh, especially a lot of uh, custom-made belt buckles. And, you know, my thing is go oh. big. Because, you know, if you, if you do a design, okay, well, in this case, what I try to do is I want to showcase these natural materials, okay? And this is phosphorciterite. Uh, that's the lavender, beautiful lavender uh, freeform uh, beads you see there. And then this is natural Australian pink opal. Yeah. There's only two pink opals that I've, in 47 years of doing this, that I've actually been able to work with. And this is, uh, you got the Peruvian pink and you got this Australian pink. So there's not a lot of pink opals out there in the world. And then we paired it back to this natural phosphorciterite. Yeah. Now, this material, um, I, you know, like when you say this is phosphorciterite, everybody naturally assumes that that's what all phosphorciterite looks like. No, uh, in, in, in fact, if I brought what a normal phosphorciterite is, the natural phosphorciterite that the average person would, would see or be able to obtain, you would go, you're not really gonna put that in jewelry, are you? And really? what it, they use it for a lot of industrial uh, applications you probably have in your really? life and you don't even realize it they grind it into a really fine powder and it's like um, it's like uh, graphite right they use it as a lubricant okay. this material this phosphorociderite right here is a very very rare form of phosphorociderite and this is really jewelry grade really gem grade material you know, when you get this naturally normally I, I would I would bring one of my specimens on but I I just I was just so weighted down with specimens <laughs> that there was no way I could put, put more um, you know, uh, in, in the bag. So I didn't bring it this time. But the phosphorociderite, when you see it naturally, it, it is this clean. 
And you know, like my, my uh, the one thing that I always tell everybody, they'll call me and they'll say, do, do you think this is real? They'll send me a picture or whatever. Mm -hmm. If it looks too good to be true, usually it is. In this case, phosphor, this phosphorosiderite looks too good to be true. It's too clean. You wouldn't think that it, that cannot be natural, but it is. It's so, it's gorgeous. And if you love your pinks and your purples, if you, and, and here's the thing, one of the biggest fashion stories coming up in the year will be pink, 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 pink. Um, everybody's talking about pink. In fact, we're doing a photo shoot and tons of us are wearing pink. I'm gonna be wearing like hot pink pants in this shoot we're doing. And it is just gonna be the it color uh, because uh, quite frankly, the Barbie movie is coming out pretty soon. So that's one of the reasons it's really driving it. So you're seeing pink everywhere and so if you love that or if you're a lavender girl maybe you're part of that hat club and you wear the purple stuff you're going to absolutely adore this and I see this envision this when you've got like I've got Colleen's really cool top on and I've just got a really basic little Rhonda Shear cami on and boom look how this fills let me kind of slide this over but look this is okay I mean it's fine it's a great little something but look what happens when you fill that neckline up with this beautiful bold powerful piece by the way really comfortable too. I think a lot of times when we think about bigger look necklaces, we worry like, oh, is it gonna weigh too much? Is it gonna be too heavy? It is surprisingly lightweight for these stone combination. Because we did, what did we do the other day that was real beefy? Um, it was an Emma, it was that, that the one that comes in layers, it was super cool. Amazonite, was Amazonite? it Amazonite, that big chunky yeah. thing? That was really weighty. I mean, that, that had some weight heavy. to it. Oh yeah, I know you, what you're talking yeah, about. Yeah, this one is so much lighter. It's very light, it's very easy to wear this one. Yeah, um, God, that was uh, Indonesian uh, Amazonite, or no, Mozambique Amazonite. There it was, yeah. It was a cool necklace, but just if you're worried about going to a bigger necklace and you're like, I don't know if I can wear that 100%, you're gonna love it. And think about the compliments you'll get. You know your girlfriend's like, where did you get that necklace? It is so cool. Because guess what? Have you ever seen anything like this? And I've been working with Jay for a long time, never seen this combination in 18 years. That's really amazing, and you're gonna have so much fun with it. All right, so my producer is giving me a break. And he said, we're going to go ahead and show this item that's not supposed to air until the very bloody end of next hour. And I said, nope, we're not waiting that long. Are you ready? This is a gorgeous blue opal necklace. Now, the challenge with this is how many do I have left? That's the problem. Going into the show, we just have a handful. Originally, this was $225. We are basically $100 dollars off right now and look at how glorious this is if you love the color that i'm wearing if you wear and i do too a lot of the khakis a lot of the sand oyster taupe colors you can see it's stunning right but if you are a blue jean baby if you're like man i love my chambrays my indigos i love my denims this is for you as well for me i wear i love wearing white i wear a lot of white pants in the summertime it's great back to that your blue that you're wearing this would be a gorgeous necklace on you tonight jay i must say wait can i just put it up to your collar <laughs> he's like ah, you're making me nervous wait hold on but really look look at your blues it's in his gorgeous blue eyes look at that honestly look how gorgeous that is with his outfit tonight okay isn't that it's his first time you modeled isn't it it, it is and probably is not <laughs> a real selling point yeah. no, <laughs> i loved your tones of blue so if you wear a lot of blues, um, go ahead and grab this early. We're down to the final, final quantity on that, $100 off. And it's a dream necklace. You're going to love it so the much. The largest carat weight uh, natural blue opal necklace that we've ever created. Is it really? That, it's stunning, too. All right, now we're going to go kind of in a whole different direction. And this is actually a green opal. We're kind of having an opal moment here. Just so you'll know, everybody, on most of his necklaces, you're going to get two and three quarters of an inch. We have this at the highest, but please don't get freaked out about that you have and I'll do it to the complete lowest now you have a lot of room to work with when you put it look at that isn't that lovely and we have the matching earrings first time ever at this price it has never been on sale and I've only got less than 200 in each option so this is interesting where do you find green opal okay well th that's the whole point you you do find green opal in various forms uh, around the world but um, this is a natural green opal, and this material comes from a good friend of ours in Madagascar. But look at how clean this is, right? I mean, this is, it's a translucent natural green opal. It comes from high in the north, uh, so I'm trying to get my bearings here, northwest region of Madagascar, high in the highlands. 
it was a very, very small uh, deposit. And it came in a, a small, what they call volcanic stope, a geothermal stope. Um, and that's how, uh, how a lot of these types of opals are formed. It's, this is all natural. And this is really kind of a rare opal. I can't, I can't say that I have an exclusive on everything, but on this one, this one deposit, we pretty much bought everything that was mined out of it. Um, I don't think that uh, she's found any more since, but it's really, really a unique opal. Anybody who's watched us for any length of time, you know the two things that we specialize in. We specialize in number one, turquoises and turquoises from around the world, and opals and opals from around the world. And this is really, um, you know, a lot, of, a lot of our viewers over the years, I, um, uh, that I've known, they they've now have these huge turquoise collections, and they also collect opal. And this would be a great opal to collect. Because it's so unique. It's unique, and it's not something that um, that you'll... Well, on this particular opal right here, we don't even have any more, and I doubt that we'll ever see it again. Like I said, it came out of that one per, uh, particular deposit. Now, let's just take a moment, Jay, and let's talk about all the handwork that goes into this. And if we can, Mark, and believe it or not, I'm going to attempt to hold my hand still. <laughs> and I really, really want you to see how magnificent the silversmithing is on this. I mean, look at the back of that. Now, how many people are going to see the very back of this necklace? Nobody, right? You'll see it, but nobody else, right? But look at all the finishing touches. That's just what Jay brings us. It's so high-end. Everything about his design are unique and they're unusual, they're exotic, they're high-end, they're beautifully made. And then to get these on sale, you're just, you just amass the most interesting and fascinating jewelry wardrobe. You know what you end up? You're the one gal that all your friends expect to have that new thing on from Jay. And they're, you, are you that person? You're like, oh, pfft, I wouldn't be caught dead in a herringbone. You know what I mean? Like a herringbone, are you kidding me? But this kind of jewelry, you really are amassing just the almost like a museum level of jewelry where a curator has gone out and picked these really unique and different pieces. And I find that's the spirit of Jay's collection. If you're a big collector, or even if you're starting brand new, you've never seen anything like this. I'm sure you have it, right? But that's what you should expect when you're watching Jay. Just so you know, again, 18 inches, you've got your extender. By the way, most of his pendants can be worn independently. And I do have a collar available, so you could wear this longer and then put the silver collar with this on and sort of frame the idea. Plus Plus, don't forget, we have the matching earrings. Big deal on that. We've got those awesome dangle earrings that are beautiful. All right, coming up, you guys, I just got an update from my producer, Jared. He said, you all are loving it, and it 100% makes sense. I think this is one of the best values. In fact, Jay, you were on the air when you called this a mini today's special. And I thought, man, is that, I watched that part, and I said, he's 100% right on that. Think about this. Can we do this, Mark? Can we just look at this pendant? This is a massive, massive heart. And it's three-dimensional. Yeah, okay, look at this. So this, it's a puff heart. So even, if you see, if you turn it around. Yeah, look at it, that. It's, but that's all one solid piece of turquoise. It's, I Can can't imagine, imagine how much you I mean, used. No, imagine yeah. the size of the piece of turquoise right. that we had to do natural turquoise. That's not, that's not compressed material. That's one solid piece of turquoise. Think okay. about how big a piece we had just to cut that. Well, and then look at the silver. I love, too. And this is kind of cool. You did, um, you did the, um, God, it's still in my mind, too. When you do the black. To oh, it's vintage. oxidized. Oxidized, thank you. You did the <laughs> oxidation, which made it super cool and vintage looking, right? Then you guys, you're not just getting this. Now, if I went to Taos, New Mexico and tried to buy this, and look how big this is, it's just giant, right? You could spend over $200 for just this part. Oh, by the way, you get this necklace to go with it, so yeah. Oh, and did I mention you get the third piece, the, th the two necklaces and the heart for under $220. You guys, that's unbelievable. Now, just a little heads up, we're down to the final quantities on this. We have less than 200 remaining, and that's gone and gone and gone. I doubt Jay could ever do it. And by the way, you could wear all this independently. These aren't little baby beads either. They're not little seed beads. Just so good, right? And gosh, I could just see you in this. A white blouse or a white top or anything in browns in the fall. Oh, it'll be just glorious. <laughs> okay, I and I will guarantee it. you this. I what? will make one guarantee right now. You'll never see that again. There's no way we could do it. We use this, it took over six pounds 
six pounds of natural turquoise per necklace, for this set. You're getting two massive, two massive um, uh, necklaces, necklaces and then that massive <laughs> pendant, which you have to have a massive piece. But it, each piece, it, we had to start with about six pounds of turquoise. To get to here. Start, to get to there. And all the silver. And it's never going to happen <laughs> again, ever. Well, here's the thing. There's certain times, it's coming up in five, um, and there's certain times where I'm on the air. I only get to see pictures before I actually get to the set, right? And I go backstage and I look really quickly, but then I have to go on the air. There's certain times where I really regret not placing my order before I stepped on the air, because I knew what was coming up obviously, right? Th this and that blue, the blue opal coming up later, these two are the two pieces in my mind that I thought, boy, for those values, I 100% should have ordered those. I mean, that's just like silly of me to skip it. I've got to listen to my instinct. It knows, it knows when I need to order something. All right, next item up. Okay, this is part of our gem focus. And Jay, I thought this was really fun because we're really taking a good amount of time and talking turquoise. And lately, if you've watched your shows over the last couple of years, turquoise Turquoise has been a little hit and miss, kind of hard to get, get to it. So to have an entire segment where we're featuring his number one best-selling stone is really fun. And this one's cool. I love it because it's got this great little swirl design. You've got two stones in the necklace. Obviously, you've got the stone in the earrings. They are a matching piece if you like them. And I really love, Jay, that you chose to do a really unique chain on this versus using stone. Right. And this is... But, but, but this design is about something that is near and dear to my heart, but this is Kingman turquoise, and this is all natural wow. blue basin turquoise. This comes from my private collection. Um, this material I've had for at least seven years, maybe a little bit longer. And here's the story with the Kingman mine. The Kingman mine is the oldest known turquoise mine in the, in the United States. There is no mine older that has a history. It dates way back even to um, er, uh, early man. Uh, the, they, they found Hoholcomb hammers in their prehistoric hammers uh, in the ca caverns in this particular deposit, this uh, particular mine. Here's the thing with the, the Kingman turquoise, especially the Blue Basin. This is completely mined out. Um, I could literally... I can literally sell the rough material for more than any, absolutely any design that I could put it in. Um, this material right now, if you tried to buy it on the open market, the raw materials would be at least 500% higher, at least five times the uh, pri original price that I paid for the material. So this is very, very limited. I don't have a lot. I've got very, very little of this particular material still left in my private collection. And as you can see, I can't really do beads or anything with it. It's all got to be cabochons. That's all I can do. And uh, just like Vicari, uh, both of those, the, that real high blue and then that real, real kind of like a tealy uh, color on that, that which is, to tell you the truth, is very rare for you actually to actually even get that. <laughs> that would be, that would actually be a mind find within a mind find there. Is it really? To get on, that. The, yeah. on the really dark, yeah. the darker For that one? really dark, dark like that, it, that Super is cool. like a, kind of what we, my beautiful British wife would call a one-off. Okay, <laughs> so that really is unused. When you get this, you're pretty, pretty, um, the standard is that real clear blue color and that is blue Basin, Jeez. you know, of, um, when I first started doing this in the early 70s, I know you don't think I look that old, <laughs> but and when I started doing it in the early 70s, I bought from 26 individually different American mines at that time, and this is the only mine of those 26 that is still operational well, and that they're still getting uh, getting material out. And there. can I give you a little heads up? You had a Kingman Blue ba Basin piece with Linny earlier. Early sold and out. And guys, it's, it's like on fire. We have like 59 pieces left. I think you guys in sold four or 500. The, the rest of it In the sold necklace, out. Yeah. right. Yeah, the necklace and just the necklace, all yeah, all the matching pieces are gone. Here's another opportunity. So if you missed out on that one, everybody understands how rare and unusual this is. And you want something really, really different. I think it's very contemporary. I think it's really modern. I think it's really youthful looking. And again, a little lighter than some of the big pieces, but grab this because this is that same blue basin Kingman mine that was so popular in the earlier show. Now, 
If you wonder what is that necklace that's the only part of that available, we're going to show it to you right now. And there's literally 59 available. Check out the price. Can you, oh, there's 50. Can you zoom in on the price? How do we make that bigger? Oh, I guess it's on the screen too. No, no, I want to show the price on the, on the, yeah. Because there is a way to make that giant because you kind of have to see it. It's unbelievable. <laughs> Okay, maybe we can't get it bigger. Okay, that's a little challenge for my for my producer. <laughs> All right, so here's the scoop. If you want to see the other one, that's the one you and Lindy had on earlier. Right, this is one, and th that is the same thing. The same story. This is natural blue basin. That the you know, even Marty, who owns the mine, who is the best man at my wedding, right? Yeah. Okay, I still <laughs> haven't forgiven him. Okay, so <laughs> my best man at my wedding. I, so we go way, way back, right? In the Cobalt family, I go way, way back with him. As far as I know, if he has any of this material, he has specimens because he doesn't have any of the rough. It is completely gone. They're getting some incredible turquoise out of the Kingman deposit right now, but it's very, very limited and oh. it's extremely, extremely expensive. Jay, there's 40 left. Lynn was over the moon about it. Like, I wish I didn't even get a chance to you know what? It Lynn, okay, Lynn actually bought this. She bought the yeah, whole set. I know she did. So, you know, and I was so know jealous. The, okay, with these guys though, you know, with with um, you know, the, you know, you guys see jewelry constantly, Tons, yeah, right? So yeah. I mean, yeah, so it's really that's probably the biggest compliment I get all all day long is that Lynn bought the whole set when she saw it. She saw it just before she came on. She actually saw it and she went, got on her phone, and she ordered it. So okay, I and mean, just FYI, that, that's there's 35 of those left. Okay, and then we're going to show you the ring. We're going to show you the earring. Those are the matching pieces. If you want to do exactly what Lenny did, the blue one, and she was wearing it, and it just was so striking. Like, I stopped and watched. I was like, oh my gosh, that necklace is stunning. So there's the other two pieces. They're all wildly limited. I know those are going to sell out. In fact, I tried to get them into our show, but we had so few, it wasn't, they didn't even, they are like, no, you, we're just going to show it digitally. So there you go. Just wanted to show you what Lenny was all cuckoo about. That's the exact same turquoise, though, that you're seeing in the two pieces we have in front of right, us. Which so, is blue base. And again, if you're a collector and you and you want to collect the rare turquoises and the turquoises, the, the blue basin is gone. It's completely mined out. They've already, they've, um, I've got great shots, footage of, of me flying over the blue basin. Uh, and there was like this beautiful uh, turquoise lake that they, that had developed where, where the turquoise was. Um, and now that whole part of the mountain's already leveled and they've backfilled all that and they've moved to a, a totally different location. No kidding. So that is completely mined out. This is like, I will tell you right now, number one, this is the stupid deal for the two hours, okay? <laughs> no, really, come on. This is beyond so stupid. Funny. I will never ever, so good. ever repeat this, okay? <laughs> Let me say that ever, 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 ever. It's impossible. I Even this turquoise, this turquoise, when I did it, I had to literally dust the cobwebs off the buckets to be able to even use this turquoise. This, this turquoise, when, um, when we uh, pulled it out, um, the buckets were labeled with a date. This was mined. This was mined over 20 years ago. Get out over of here. Over 20 years ago. Um, and the only reason, I, I'm just going to give you just an FYI here to you, and you can turn that around. I'm going to sure. show the I'm other show side. Both too, sides, yeah. Can we turn it? You, yeah, show it, show it on both Let me sides. Flip it. Sure. So I think that that's cool. You actually get two, you get two <laughs> different looks. Here, here's the thing, okay? Um, I, the only reason that I could even make this in the first place was to use turquoise that I had mined over 20 years ago and use the prices that turquoise was 20 years ago. So you, so you honored the original price I, you bought it at. Okay. I honored the original rough price <laughs> that was 20 years. Now, could I have sold it for a ton more? Absolutely. But I'd already committed to this, right? Yes. <laughs> to doing this. So we went ahead and bit the bullet, okay, and we did it. This is ridiculous. It's a stupid, stupid value. It takes six pounds 
Six pounds of natural rough. This is the natural color. This is natural turquoise. This is uh, from the old Iron Mountain deposit. Gorgeous. And so, you know, this has been mined out forever and ever. You can't even get the material. This was some of the original material that came out that was kind of the, the topper, the more the green. Later on, um, it turned into a, a little bit more of a blue with like a, uh, still had kind of like that copper matrix in it, that beautiful copper matrix. But you can't buy this material. You can't go anywhere and even get it. But it took six pounds, mm. six pounds of the natural material to be able to cut two necklaces. And then what really sets this apart and what is so stupid, I want everybody to think <laughs> about, well, here, you uh, let's give them a demonstration. Sure. Okay, okay, look at, look at the size Okay, this is a natural turquoise nugget. Look at the size of this piece of turquoise right here. Right. You couldn't cut that right, with that, that face. We would have to cut this like on this there. face. Do you see? And it would barely fit in. Wait, let me ask you a question. How many beads can you make out of this chunk? Well, like just okay, regular well, beads. it depends on what bead that you Well, what, just what on an make. average. Well, it depends on small, small, small bead, beads. large bead, or whatever. Well, but my whole point being, you could have made okay. a couple necklaces right. out of this okay. versus just this. Right. <laughs> okay, but if you, if you look, <laughs> we still want to talk about so, this, Mark. It's Mark, so good. We're still talking oh, about this. Please. That's one of two mistakes I've made today. That was a big mistake. <laughs> oh, so I, now he's cutting us off. Yeah, he's now like, he's we got to take a break. Y'all just stop. <laughs> now, don't forget, this is the other one. It's a hundred dollars off. That is blue opal. It's not coming up until next hour. And I know, I think we've sold it over a hundred already. That's, it's incredible too. So, oh, can you do it real fast? Before we take the break, I want you guys, if you saw what happened here, right? This is $100 off. All right, guys, I have about 400 left, and that's gonna be gone, and it's glorious. I love the color, I love everything about it. I love it so feminine. I think it's so beautiful. It looks great on Jay, too, so there you go. Anyway, <laughs> I don't think he wants to model it again, but we'll see. Any more, more with Jay King here at HSN in just a second. <laughs> out funds out and hsn has the summer style sneak peek you've been waiting for your first look at summer ready fashions and accessories tune in to our summer style sneak peek tonight at midnight only on hsn love watching hsn then take us with you in the hsn app everything on your tv is streaming live on your phone anytime any place we're always with you download the iphone or android app today We love our gemstones to be beautiful, colorful, and durable. That's why we give some of them a little more love. Enhancements may require special care and may not be permanent, while others may last a lifetime. For more information, visit hsn.com and search gemstone care to see our gemstone enhancement chart. I grew up in a setting related to food. Cooking for me became a passion. My culinary line, Lydia's Kitchen, is special because behind it is my 50 years of experience of cooking. I hope that this cookware will make things easier in the kitchen and bring beauty to your home. This is my only cookware line and it's exclusive to HSN. Watch Lydia's Kitchen by Lydia Bastianich. Friday, April 28th, only on HSN. That was Chris and Cola, 250 grand. Did anybody who was watching that, did you see that yard that was Marty and I standing there? And do you see that all that blue turquoise and everything? That was the blue basin. Oh and that was me actually when I was buying that material. And really? I, that was me at Kingman. And that was so long ago, that was seven years ago. Do you notice how I, I wasn't quite as skinny? <laughs> <laughs> and Marty right now, I, when I, I just saw him a couple weeks ago, he's, he's got the, almost the same hair. He used to give me a bunch of, you know, about, about my hair. Yeah. And now I said, oh. Look at you, you know, Marty. You know, 
touch up there, cowboy. <laughs> <laughs> They've been friends for a very, very long time. <laughs> All right, Jay, so we're kind of going to go in a whole different direction. Uh, by the way, that turquoise heart is gone. The next one, just a little heads up, my producer goes now. This is limited. Here we go. This is an HSN deal. There's 100 left, and it's like a whole different experience because it's super cool. First off, the th first thing we're looking at is the pendant. Now, what's really unique is that is lapis, but you can reverse it and just flip it around, and now you've got this gorgeous turquoise side. Now, I do have the matching earrings in lapis or in turquoise. And Jay, I got to tell you, I really love the simplicity of this. Okay, and we, we actually, it's, it, I'm, I'm, it's kind of funny you would say that because the reason that we designed this and designed this, this whole kind of ensemble, where we were getting a lot of uh, uh, viewer requests for something just simple, something just contemporary, Easy. simple, just that splash of color. So this for us is simple, okay? So, but um, we always have to give you the biggest bang for the buck, right? So in this case, we made the pendant reversible. So you're paying one price, but you're getting two awesome looks from that. And what you have here is super high grade. This is all AAA grade lapis. It doesn't get any better. This is a kind of lapis that you would normally just see in gold. Nobody in their right mind would ever set it in silver. And then um, on the other side, you're getting that amazing uh, Campitos blue ice. Okay, this, um, that's the reverse side of that pendant. And that uh, is Campitos blue ice. A lot of people compare that to Sleeping Beauty. To tell you the truth, I mean, I, there's ways that I can tell what it is. Um, a lot of this is actually uh, people that do have it, if they do have it, a lot of it's being marketed as Sleeping Beauty because oh, really? it's that clean. Wow. Um, but um, there are a couple of little uh, nuances that you, that for, you know, for me that I can tell if, it, uh, if it's the Campitos material. Um, these are both really, really high grade materials and the Campitos uh, blue ice is so limited. We got the, the it, that mine's been closed for a, over, I, I think we're going on like 15 years now, something like that. Uh, I know it's more than 12 and I, I think this year, because you know, I, every year, I, I, it just seems like time is flying by, but I think it's been closed for about 15 years. This material, when it's gone, it's gone. I have people that know I have this material. They know I have rough. I don't have as much as I used to. We got the last two loads. The last two known loads of this material that came out of the, Compit the Compitos Blue Ice. There were other different Compitos materials that, that people were uh, mining, but the Blue Ice only came from two specific mines, two sp specific shafts. And we got the last two loads that I'm aware of uh, that ever came out of that mine before they shut it down. And it is shut down. The only one, there is still tons of turquoise there, but because of the safety issues that were created by how they were mining it, the only way that they could actually uh, open that mine back up would be go in there and do an open pit mine and actually cut it open. And you're, you're looking at probably, you know, the most expensive thing you'll ever do is move dirt. <laughs> and um, it, funny? Would, it would literally probably cost uh, 50 to $100 million just to, to get down to the level. Get out of here. Yeah. All right, and I, I, you guys recognize how cool that simplicity you know, is? It you is know what sold I love out. is people actually understand the collectability of, of the of these, of yeah. these materials. Well, plus it's just super cool. I mean, again, I think for summer, some, lot, for a lot of us, spring, summer, you want something a little bit lighter, something that's just kind of really sort of sexy. And you think about, you know, I used to, one of my favorite pieces is this little teeny set of diamonds that go down linearly, and there's just something really gorgeous about you know, that. You know, and a lot of times, you know, um, well, and that's what I do, uh, is my, my design designs are always real, I, although I can't take credit for that design. But I, I like simple, you know, and I, I like to show this to and I like simplicity. That's beautiful. But also, that's, what's, that's why I used to design, a, just so everybody knows, when we started out 27 years ago, all the mind fine designs you saw were 100% me. Um, now there's four of us uh, that design. And um, we each have our own little kind of, you know, our look. And so I think that that's what makes Mind Finds really interesting. And here again, I wish I could take credit for this, but as well, you said, you knew it wasn't me. <laughs> I knew that was not Jay. Um, by the way, I do, we still have the elongated earrings, either in the turquoise or in the um, lapis. lapis. And again, look how look how beautiful these are. But we do you know want to talk really about the great, collar. Even with your hair, yeah. you know, and she, she wears her hair down. Okay, long hair. My wife's the same way. Um, 
uh, but you know, you could have, she could have on the greatest earrings that I've ever made for her or that friends have made for her that, I mean, are just amazing. And sometimes I want to take her hair and go like that, pull it back and say, look, look at her earrings. Look at her earrings. What, what's cool with these, even, even if you wear your hair longer, you can see them. Isn't that, look at the movement. Isn't that fun? Look at that. Isn't, that, isn't that fun? And they're they elongating. Yes. Okay, these are coming up, but I do want to talk about the collar briefly. I have done the last couple of shows with Jay with absolutely zero, probably the I, last several shows, no collars available. Uh, what I did is I popped this one that's coming up. It comes with its own beaded necklace, but look how cool this is, and you're going to see the difference between taking it off the beaded necklace and adding it to it, i.e., the heart we just had that sold out in the turquoise, throwing that on this collar changes everything. Now, it's 16 inches, but do not get freaked out about that. There's plenty plenty of room, and you can obviously stretch it a little bit to accommodate your neckline. But Jay, what I love about your collars so much is it takes all those wonderful pendants you make with the beaded necklaces and gives us a whole lot more options on how to wear them. You know, what's great about these collars, too, is you have something, honestly, that can, if you just want to splash the silver, you can pop on. And we hand, okay, these are hand done. They're handcrafted from sterling silver sheet material, right? And so... Um, they're form fitted to fit your collarbone. So they lay right. So you could just wear the collar by itself, but as Suzanne just demonstrated here so wonderfully, is they're great. You can just pop on anything. Just it doesn't on. have to, any mind fine pendant will fit on this, but it doesn't have to be a mind fine pendant. Maybe you have that awesome um, pendant that you have from another designer or right. something. It's a great way to display it, but it's also a standalone design. It really is. It's so, e it's fun. It's a great piece to take on vacation, too. All right, got to give you a quick update. Oh, Lenny's favorite. It is now sold out completely. Congratulations. Right, are the earrings and the rings still available, though? Oh, good. Okay, so yeah, the earrings and rings still available. And I always tell everybody, watch your budget, but here's the thing. That, that material is so limited, and we won't have it. We're, we're literally, I put it out with an eyedropper, uh, the material that I have. <laughs> I, don't, really? I don't have a lot of material left, and I don't have any really big material left. Okay, so there are the other pieces. They're still available. You can check it all out on hsn.com. Unfortunately, though, good for you grabbing the beautiful, beautiful necklace. Um, we also have the earrings now we're going to talk about. Just talk about sexy. I mean, I really love elongated earrings. Number one, makes your face look uh, thinner, which I'm always for. But number two, there's just sort of something really sexy about wearing these. And look again at that Campitos blue turquoise. It's just so vivid and so veinless. You know, it just really looks so high-end. And very similar to Sleeping Beauty. Now we have both of them available. Both are on sale. Your lapis is, or I'm sorry, the HSN deal. The lapis is 98. Your turquoise is 107. The length on this comes in at two and a quarter inches, and you have a little shepherd's hook and sterling silver holding them on. You know what's interesting about it? You definitely can see them, but they're almost weightless. Well, and here again, uh, one of the one of the reasons that that is too is because they're all hand done, they're handcrafted, mm -hmm. right? So they're um, the the it's the the process on how they make them. So where you know if you cast a piece and you really have to make it really thick, right? Mm -hmm. So that um, it will because you're pouring molten silver, right? Right. When you hand do them, right? You can use sheet material, um, so mm -hmm. you can actually it still gives you. Uh, the tensile strength, but you don't have that that weight that you really don't need. Like it's dragging your ears right. down, yeah. Right. Well, not that I wear pierced. I only wear <laughs> well, you clip, clip ons. Use clip-ons, yes. <laughs> <laughs> and that's only at home on special occasions. <laughs> only when I'm dressing like a pirate. And that's, <laughs> that's only right. at Halloween. That's right. Or uh, Gasparilla. <laughs> All right, one, two, three, four, five. You get six days. You know, there's just something. Oh, there's 90 left in the turquoise. These are going to totally sell out. But a lot of times when you see Jay, you'll see he'll do the beaded uh, earrings or he'll do we have a, a beautiful malachite study ring coming up and those are all great but i really really think you're going to love this elongated design it's just easy to wear you throw them on it's almost for me it looks like you're just very effortlessly incredibly chic and, and again it just there's something about them i love the way they move i love the way they dangle and again not heavy it's not like oh i'm wearing such heavy earrings they're incredibly comfortable the turquoise is going to sell out though if that is your choice please don't wait there's 70 left in the turquoise. I've got just a hair bit more in the lapis. And I do want you to address the lapis really quickly okay. because of the quality of it. Uh, well, if you look at these and really 
what you're looking at is the simplicity of the design, right? But it really is kind of like that upscale, that, you know, that really upscale look. And you've got, in both of these materials, okay, in the lapis, nobody in their right mind would ever put this grade of lapis in silver, <laughs> right? This is really, this grade of lapis, this is all AAA grade lapis. Another thing, this all comes from one location. It comes from the Hindu Kush region of Afghanistan. It's impossible to get this material. I haven't been able to get any of this material. Now it will be going on eight years. So what you're looking at is material that, um, that I have put back over 25 years um, it's the only reason I even have any of that great material. Again, the Kempitos blue ice. It is so clean, so clear, that amazing, amazing blue. Okay, so now, Jay, we're going to go in a whole different direction. Yeah, and you guys were loving this earlier. We gave you kind of a sneak peek at it. The, 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 I think the neat thing about this necklace is not only the combination of the turquoise and the spiny oyster, but I just think it's really fresh and light and fun and easy to wear. You know, it, and it's under $100. I mean, that's pretty darn amazing. We also have the matching earrings, just so you'll know. Those are available as well. And this is new for the visit. You just actually just launched this, right? We just launched this, and this is Heavenly Well Lake Turquoise, okay? And I can say, this is one of those turquoises, I can say I have an exclusive on this. Nobody really? has any of this material um, for a couple different reasons, okay? But uh, we got the only load that came out of it before the world shut down. <laughs> okay. Did you really? Yeah, so we got the only load the only known load of this material ever to be mined. We were really wow. super excited about it. It was a brand new mine, um, a brand new turquoise deposit. Nobody knew anything about it, and we were able to obtain it. Um, and then, yeah, you know, everything happened. We all know what happened, <laughs> and everything shut down. Um, I'm actually... Uh, we're working through, I've got very little of this material. I'm working on tr trying, I do have my visa now, but uh, to, I, I don't want to get into it too much, but it's kind of sketchy. I know I can get in. I'm not too you sure. Me so I'm not nervous. too sure. No, I'm not. I don't really, know how your honestly, wife sleeps at night when you travel. I, I'm not. Uh, <laughs> are you kidding? She'd be more than happy if they kept me. <laughs> worried about I'm worried about somebody dropping a dime and saying oh you know I I didn't want to That's I terrible. didn't want to mention anything but this <laughs> this I've heard this man suspicious but um I'm gonna try you know I I'm I'm kidding and not kidding in a way <laughs> so I will be um I've, I've already got my visa I'm gonna try to go in at the end of May we've got a trip planned and I'm gonna try to get back to this mine. There's no way, I, I, there's no way, I don't even know if they've gone back in and they've started digging again. But here, I just, I've been, I'm, you know, I'm a, I'm a picture straightener okay. and you can do the same thing on yours. Okay, so this is really cool because it's really unique. So this is spiny oyster, right? But spiny oyster has holes in it sometimes for where the spines were growing in there. And so one of my artists, one of my lavenders, you know, one day I it was, went to his, his desk and he's doing, he's working away and I'm going, what are you doing? And he's going, I'm filling these holes with turquoise. <laughs> Is that what he did on this? So he actually came oh up my with this gosh. idea. Okay, Wait. think about how crazy. Y'all gotta zoom no, in no, on that. Think how crazy this is. <gasps> so he took the spiny oyster, and that's the color oh, side oh of the gosh. oyster. You can see the other side, yeah, that's kind of the mother pearl. Yeah. So that's why you want to turn it around. Okay, so you get that vivid, vivid orange, uh, in this case, the, the orange spiny. And then there's holes where the spines, um, a lot of times, you know, with the spines, you always, so when you buff off the spines, you have these holes in the shell. And it, you know, it doesn't look good, doesn't look right. And so he came up with this idea it's that to take the turquoise and inlay turquoise in all those holes. And so- That's for, great. For this project, I thought, you know what? That's really right, a, attention one. to detail. Look at that's that. Unique. That's different. So we went ahead and did it. I think it's just super cool. Great value. And you know, of all the values, you know, Suzanne and I got together. Actually, she called me earlier because as you noticed, she was sleeping on the job. Anybody, I'm not <laughs> If you missed that anything, show. <laughs> not saying anything. <laughs> At least you were modeling my, our jewelry. Yes, uh, I was. Know, while so, I was sleeping. Yeah, we, while you I were sleeping. I was adorned in his jewelry. Yeah, so that, that was really cool. But um, 
uh, of, you know, is this clever. is one of the designs that, that we're showing for this two hour presentation that really are, it's, it's really unique, it's something different. And it's really, really one of the great values. I think that, that is absolutely tonight. the most clever idea. Filling well, those little holes with those tiny pieces but, of turquoise. That's you so know, cool. If, if I could just paint the picture for you. I mean, yeah. and here again, these are lapidaries. Really cool. And they're sitting there and they're cutting. And, uh, you know, can I do that? I, I can. Okay. I can cut and do lapidary. But the, when they do lapidary, I mean, um, it, takes, it would take me like 15 minutes to cut that bead. And it takes them like, it seems like five seconds, yeah, right? Right, right? So, you know, it really is an art, it is a skill. But to see him over there, and he is just totally concentrating. I mean, completely concentrating. He's just affixed on this project he's working on. Yeah. And it's not even something he's supposed to be working on, <laughs> right? <laughs> and so, That's but, great. but he came up with this brilliant idea. And it's, it's really, really so cool. Clever. And each one is uh, inlay like, each uh, and each they'll of all be totally different beads. I mean that's kind of nature's gift to well, inlay all the little holes look, that's you know so and neat. the holes again I mean yeah how brilliant is that it's so brilliant. they're all going to be a little bit different a little bit uh, uh, you know unique and this um, this uh, material uh, the heavenly well lake like I said we got the only known load that came out. This is kind of like the, more of the tealy color that I separated. It also comes in this. In fact, this is a piece of Ooh, well So wow. as you can see, and this is what's so crazy with turquoise. Right so there. this actually is Heavenly Well Lake too, and this is Heavenly Well Lake. This was the greener material, the tealier material that was more on top, and this was uh, the material, the uh, uh, the bigger material that was the, the that we were getting into the vein that they were getting into as just before it did close down. So oh, I'm excited cool. because I think if they if they open it back up, I think they're going to be on top of some really high blue. And just so you see, um, our sale price tonight, it's it's basically $54 off. I mean, we always say this, it's amazing to get a genuine turquoise necklace, and in this case with a spiny oyster and that clever little micro inlay, um, for under $100. I mean, we buy fashion jewelry that's more than $100. You know, we buy costume jewelry because that matches the dress that's more than $100. So really, I think Jay does a brilliant job of spoiling the heck out of us. Because if you've ever, if you buy turquoise and you're buying Jay's jewelry, we rarely shop anywhere else, but just take a sniff around, whether it's on the internet or whatever. First off, are you ever going to find this? No, he's the only one that has it, but just go out every now and then, or maybe compare. You will come back and you will shop Jay's line only because this is an incredible, incredible value and how versatile and easy to wear. You know, it's funny, the spiny oyster too, it sort of lightens up the whole experience of the necklace, you know, kind of breaks up some of that green. Well, and I just think it's little things like that. It's the attention to detail. It's the little things that are different. And that's that's what's cool about mind finds, and I think that um, that's what people love about mind finds. You yeah. can tune in, and you're always going to see materials you, I guarantee, you're never going to see anywhere else. You're going to always see designs and ideas that you won't see anything else, and they're all made exclusively here for the show. We are not only the designers, we're the manufacturers. All right, guys, and here are the earrings, the same little micro inlay in there. That's as clever as can be. What detail. Those are available $59.95, so you can check those out as well. All right, we've got to move on. Oh, the Chilean. So we were talking about this earlier, and I'm on the phone with Jay, and he goes, oh okay. my gosh, the Chilean right. is no, coming no, no, up. No, no. Okay, what did I promise you? You promised you had the best samples in the world. <laughs> <laughs> oh, those are rather relatively <laughs> small for what you created. Okay. What the no, heck? But these are, okay, all right. This so, is cool. This, you know, and here's the thing. Picture's worth a, a thousand words, but this, uh, I, brought, I brought these samples just to show everybody this is the real, real deal. And uh, these are the cool things that make this work. Um, that is so know, cool. We well, how, how okay. why does it look like this? Yeah, okay. Why does Chilean so, look this way? Okay, no, th it, this is <laughs> Chilean, but not all of it looks like this. Okay, look, here's what we did. See this? This is a nugget. That's a natural nugget. That, all of that, that's what you did. So we were looking at this, and what I was trying to do is, how do you design something to keep that natural look, but that you don't grind all that off and lose all that material? All that so we took these nuggets, and we cut them in half, and made them into cabochons. So you, how cool is oh, this? Oh, that's clever. How cool is that? You get the natural look. Yeah. Right? This is the natural look. That is the natural nuggets. These are natural nuggets. That's how these come. This, this is, all I've done is polish that nugget up. 
And then we took them and we cut them in half right, so and made them sides. into cabochons. Yeah. So instead of normally, what would we do on something like this? Normally we would take this and we would cut that all off. We would cut all these natural fissures and everything would be cut off and it'd be smoothed down. So when you're removing turquoise, what are you doing? You're losing turquoise because it turns into dust. Therefore, what are you doing? You're actually inflating the cost of the material. Oh, right? um, yes, of course. So by doing it like this, you get this cool look, you get a natural look, and you, the, I mean the natural nugget look, and we're able to do it and keep the price really reasonable for this size. This is a major, look at the size really cool. of the